creating has always been the most potent and soothing medicine and comfort in any difficult time in my childhood, teenagehood or as an adult. Of course, making a living with my art, I for sure create all day long. But the truth is, creating since my childhood has always been a necessary remedy that helps balance my mood, keeps me happy, optimistic, during any difficult time, sadness. It's a refuge and a place of peace that can be visited and explored by no others but me. And those characters, those stories, those landscapes are always available at any time by the simple act of sitting at my desk. Taking a pair of scissors, a brush, a pencil, it creates a transition between two realities, two worlds, as if these basic, simple tools were real, precious, magical keys, which could open the door to another world, where worries, sadness, challenges are totally banished. A magical secret kingdom which is always there. The desk becomes this magical chip which helps travel in another world. In those difficult moments, whatever project I was or I am working on, it had the immediate consequence to refuel and lift me up and comfort me in a way no other thing or person could. The freedom, the beauty, the unlimited possibilities that creating provide are of course very good explanations for that. There is the magic of colors, playing with them, mixing them. There is nothing more uplifting than colors, seeing the pigments floating on water, learning on the paper. That's such a precious healing effect. How sad it must be for people who go through difficult time in their life, sometimes live their whole life without having access to this magical realm, this magical world of creation and all its resources and unlimited possibilities, the joy and healing effect it provides. Words cannot even express that. Creating helps forgetting track of time, the reality, and creates a distance with any worries or sadness. There is of course the sensorial dimension of creating. I work with paper. I adore paper. And the thing I adore the most is the sound of paper. Creased, pleated, cut, sculpted. The sound of paper is like a sweet rhyme that calms down, hypnotizes sometimes. I just simply adore the sound of paper.
The joy and excitement of starting something new, with no limit of time, space, money. When you start something new, you of course always have artistic and technical challenges, which require thoughts, focus, concentration, but are also so precious to keep your mind busy with constructive thoughts. And then having the feeling of happiness and contentment once the project or the creation you are doing is completed. And the beauty, the joy of creating something beautiful, something more beautiful than expected sometimes, it has such a healing, powerful effect. The colors, the sounds of the tools with their repetitive movements, relax, soothe, calm down. If at different moments creating an art has been a very precious remedy for you, just let me know in the comments. I hope this video has inspired you if you are going through a difficult time and maybe you are going to use your tools, your brushes, your paints, your scissors and just see what might come out of all that. You can give a thumbs up if you liked what you saw. I have nice things coming so be sure to subscribe if you don't want to miss them. I see you very soon.